This is Kiss outside the free throw line. Doesn't go. The putback, though, does go for Shaq Dorson. And that's how the crowd makes its presence known early following that Dorson throwdown. It leads to an open rebounding opportunity. L.J. Figueroa starting tonight for the injured Kata, and he buries the three from the wing. Pulling that defense out. From the wing for three, and what a start here for St. John's. Two three-point shots. He's not going to get pushed around, let me tell you that. He first joined Michigan State as Heron sets up for three, and what a start for St. John's. This is still a new lineup. It's a different team. Outdoors to down low. And that's what Rutgers wants to do without the presence of a dominant low post player. And that was a defensive play. Could have been a double foul. Could have been a foul on Chino Maruyi. Montez Mathis into the game trying to dunk that one down. Outstanding defense from St. John's getting back. And Pons off the crossover. Step back. Tough two. How smooth was that for Shimori Pons? As good as the conference looks this year. And Rutgers opens up conference play here not too long from now against Michigan State. That'll count and one for Montez Mathis. Down low, Chom. Great feed. Johnson to Chom. Shamori Pons with five points. Yeah, that's a tough match up there. And Dorson says, I don't care about your speed. Here comes my hand. Defending Geo Baker. He played some really good defensive minutes and a comeback win for St. John's. Last time out. Harper makes this a two-point game. A nice move baseline. Mathis came over to help out. Here's Figueroa underneath off the glass. Nice fake from Dixon. And a block from Johnson. Did you impact the game in a positive way? Miles Johnson is doing just that. Figueroa is third three of the half. Quiets the crowd temporarily. I don't care who he's posted up. It's going to be a mismatch. Little pass there from Dorson. And now Figueroa. The bounce. Here's Pons. It'll count. Nice fake there from Harper. That's a freshman. Omaruyi. Shot clock late. Down low. East to Chom. Rutgers patient. And Chom dunks it home. Yeah. Reports to get a pair of sneakers. I might have read more. Chom knocks down the three. So Chom, 14 point game, made four threes in the win against Drexel here on Sunday. Now a block. Saw that Dorson Heron matchup again. They set up a quick three on two, but the gate about eternal. Harper for three. Where does Rutgers go for offense right now, John? Uh, you got to go inside first. See if you can draw two. And do that. Uh, how about that? There you go. There's your answer. Yeah, that his first two years at Rutgers did not hit one single three. It was 0 of 16. Okay. Meanwhile, Heron and St. John's are rolling on the road tonight. Because I don't know how you match up with it. You almost you have to play zone or switch everything. What are you? Follows his own wow. miss. And allows you to play with more freedom on the offensive end when you're getting stops. Johnson hammers down the missed Omarui layup. But he's just a step or so behind on the defensive end at times. Not all the time, but at times. And that's just a matter of play. And goodness gracious, the shots just keep falling. Aaron, a huge second half. Aaron off the fake, over Chop. There's not much you can do. You think Peter Kiss is going to be a... A significant player for Rutgers this season. Uh, absolutely. Uh, he's just got to get comfortable. See, he's a job. Knocked down a three and, and gets the pike for a timeout. Scorching hot St. John's team that he had to go against. It's easy to, to look at high shooting percentages and say defense has been bad. It's just hard to stop teams that are rolling. Five to shoot for Figueroa. Step back three over Chom. 23 points. St. John's defensively has done a good job of just forcing contested shots. And contested shots, even if look out, where did that go? Marcellus Erlington. That'll count. And one for Montez Mathis. St. John's, the scorching hot shooting they have displayed throughout the night, silenced the crowd. Final 15 and swatted out of bounds.